The Congolese Press Agency, citing a source close to the authorities, reports that the military prosecutor's office in the final stages of its investigation and intends to bring the case to trial. They will be held accountable for their alleged involvement in summary executions that were filmed and widely shared on social networks. It is rare in the Democratic Republic of Congo for members of the Defense and Security Forces involved in mistakes or crimes during operations to be held accountable. But this time, the alleged perpetrators of these shootings have been identified, isolated and handed over to the military prosecutor, an official told ACP. On Sunday, May 19, gunmen attacked the residence of the Member of Parliament Vital Kamehe, the presumptive president of the National Assembly. They killed two policemen from insecurity detail. The attackers, numbering around 40, then took control of Palais de la Nation, one of the head of state's offices, for a few minutes, tearing down the nation's flag and hoisting the flag of the former Zen of Marshal Mobutu. The army said it was an attempted coup that had been threatened by the defense and security forces.